Fambulem una ado this na exactly eight o'clock as we been promised una today we get a guest but you go can introduce himself we na no say like we get a series we will bring stakeholders them we will bring people them for come discuss on national issues today we guess we get boku tinden nice tinden for una very important information for una we me and inge for can discuss we me na cycle john barry the host and una stay tuned una share as many as una come uh, stay tuned stay connected Okay, fumble them. Uh, like I've been telling us, so I will let for introduce one we biggest professors, Sierra Leone. But I will let for make you introduce yourself. Can you introduce yourself, sir? Yes, uh, thank you so much, uh, my brother. Uh, been a Dr. Hajinjai and uh, the uh, lecturer from the college, but also you know, the founder for Project 1808, and also. Uh, the lecture in the U.S., uh, both uh, California University of Science and Medicine and University of Wisconsin and Madison. I mean, I'm the director for University of Wisconsin and Global One Health Centers in Africa. So, yes, yeah, so, and I do quite a bit <laughs> and uh, very happy for be part of this uh, uh, program with my brother and for discuss Sierra Leone and, and discuss issues affecting uh, people. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, Fabul them like this na Dr. Jai, uh, na a scientist. We understand you na a scientist, not so? Yes, sir. Yes, yes. yes. Okay, T tell me a bit about your work. What you did do? Yes. So yes, me na a biomedical scientist, a senior biomedical scientist. Um, they do uh, uh, basically in Sierra Leone. Most people in Sierra Leone know me because uh, I come during Ebola and uh, Sierra Leone. I uh, do a lot of the uh, big research work on Ebola and Sierra Leone, and we uh, end up for create a vaccine uh, on Ebola. But also, um, I don't be scientists uh, in in the U.S. in industry um, and in university in industry. Don't they involved in uh, Procter and Gamble, uh, Cincinnati headquarters research and development? Don't be scientists uh, developing products for over. 187 countries, over 300 brands. Um, so most of those products you they use in the house, either including some medicines, painkillers, and uh, cough medications. Uh, you know uh, things like uh, anti-dandruff shampoo, head and shoulders, or even Crest toothpaste, or even uh, you uh, basic uh, uh, this one uh, old spice uh, work. Um, and a lot of other products uh, where you can use uh, was work we developed uh, at, Pro at uh, Procter & Gamble. But uh, over in, uh, in, 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 uh, in Sierra Leone, done, they lead a lot of um, you know, research work in epidemiology in, uh, in also in the, in the realm of uh, public health. And as of recently, 2021, uh, uh, I mean, I've been the deputy incident manager for um, prepare Sierra Leone again in case of Ebola. We've been resurfaced in Guinea and also done support the Ministry of Health very recently in Sierra Leone for get a, a Bill and Melinda Gate grant, challenges grant for able to um, develop a mortality surveillance system in Sierra Leone and also 
they provide technical advice to the Ministry of Health, Sierra Leone, a lot on um, things around health emergencies and health security. So, uh, but I continue to do a lot of um, research, good Sierra Leone, US, and globally. Uh, so, science, being a scientist, that be not my job, not my data, not my career, that and thing what I do all the time. and. And, and, and definitely involved in discovering a lot of them, uh, deadly pathogens and like uh, the, some of the newer strains of Ebola, we don't find out. And we don't able also follow up, we don't follow up for the last uh, six, seven years on the survivors of Sierra Leone, on understanding their, their immunity, their immune level. So a lot of the work around understanding how survivors and immune system continues to be uh you know against ebola and uh, in the covid 19 uh, sierra leone i also lead the work on understanding uh, the prevalence of the covid 19 within the communities and people um so we do a lot of blood work and uh, in people around the country for seeing um, how much people expose how much sick how much uh, you know not get nothing for do with uh, covid 19 so and also understanding the type of variants and the type of variants, so you know, doing what they call sequencing, you know. So yeah. So right now in Sierra Leone, I did lead a very big project uh, with the Ministry of Health and the University of Sierra Leone, where now for able to find out um, which kind of sickness and they kill people in the community. Um, okay. So most times when people come to the hospital in Sierra Leone then they almost they give them typhoid malaria and most of them, in fact you go almost jokingly they say in Sierra Leone we don't develop a new type of uh, diagnosis when a typhoid malaria yeah but um and so what thing I they do right now um is um I get a research work with um set up for Connaught uh, for Troy Trans, for 34 military hospital for um for um Rokupa hospital and then for um, Ola Durin uh, Children's Hospital, the five major tertiary hospitals in uh, Freetown. And I get uh, I work with um, the clinicians, the lab people, and the surveillance people who are set up. I get a team, uh, each of those small team. And then also set up, I don't get, uh, we don't, I don't set up na, na the central public health lab, na, na Laka. So what you would do is that if you come to any of them hospital yeah, and you know it and you sickness not to then find out then come they're not able to diagnose you know it's not to malaria not to you know not to typhoid and you still they get fever you still get high temperature you still sick so then they refer them to we and then we they basically do more of the uh, diagnostics and so basically um, I able to look for more uh pathogens them uh, including uh things like dengue if not chikungunya if na you know hepatitis or na hiv or na uh, syphilis or um we can dig even further and and, and when once we able if we're not able to get to the point to what thing would be because right now they work with abbott me and abbott get a partnership about laboratories the big um the, equipment maker in, uh, in the US, a big company. So we uh, work on trying to develop high level diagnostic capability in Sierra Leone so that uh, most of the things that people and they get then sicknesses then we they know we're able to get the right medication or the right pinpoint within them get we were able to find out within them get and and find out the right pathogen and so we'll give you the right sort of treatment. So we will get back to the hospital Tell the doctors and saying that this is not the exact uh, thing where this person gets, and given this type of uh, treatment regime, um, for try to solve that problem. So they do uh, what do they call an acute febrile illness surveillance work. Um, we don't they start now on a two months in now. We don't they go in with this, and and they get a lot of um, you know, support. Um, from the different hospitals and the teams and really, really excited about this because this is now one of the major challenges at the hospital in Sierra Leone. And so, yeah, so this is something we do right now and I'm very excited about this and also the possibilities they will be able to develop 
with central laboratory system capability for diagnose um, much more and 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 also the partner with uh, the big infectious disease lab now Senegal for do additional so wherein we we test systems and are able for diagnose we they also go to Senegal and do more with IRISF in Senegal and dig further. So, so this is a good opportunity um, for we and something we they keep me busy right now. And I'd extend the same work into communities okay. where we don't we don't find out. Uh, um, well, this we 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 plan for extend them into the different regions, so the districts them uh, over time. Uh, we after this year. And also we extend for go go into communities and do also what what do they call um acute um viral hemorrhagic oh oh fumble them uh when I've been listening to Dr. Njai. Okay, don't come, don't like, come back. Yeah. Yes, yeah. We don't see many pathogens and like a like a you know, like okay. a Dr. Ebola. Doctor Jai, uh, like again, we we get wide audience. We get people mm. in with salon. Maybe some man knows a bit even pathogen. We go want for make you broke that thing and they down so that that layman we will understand. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we we get various uh, uh, tumbo them like a uh, then oh. like then uh, Ebola like a uh, Marburg Ebola na and uh, Marburg na the na causing them then similar oh. then we don't find them we don't see Marburg na na other tumbo is similar to Ebola we don't see and various villages them na na Sierra Leone Kailau Kwenadugu different side them but for their different areas we don't see the Bombali na other type of uh, Ebola strain tumbo. Oh. Um, in safe day in the Bombali area. So, but we we not ever see them don't attack people or we don't see outbreaks see it. So what thing would they try for do for be preemptive is for begin for do community, um, you know, um, sampling and, and then community sampling and they go allow we for able know whether or not this uh, pathogen them tumbu ya all the see in them them bats then other stuff then then tumbu then they actually they jump to mortal man they able jump so if then if we see you know more of them then then they appear the anti what do they call the antibodies something we go show up now your body say you don't expose to them okay. then they go give the government a, a warning a quick warning an early warning system for begin for go to them communities and set up um either you know, if not vaccinations or set up um, early interventions. So we want to make sure, say, we prevent what did being happen with the Ebola outbreak in 2014, where it take we on our ears and it begin for hit and, and ravage. And we all don't see how way Corona starts now, na, na, na China, na small, na Wuhan, and it spread all over the world. So we want to make sure, say, you know, um, you know, then kind of scenarios and they not happen to we and and take we off hand of guide so so all of them capabilities here they work on Sierra Leone and and thank you for asking and most times because i can they mostly they talk politics and uh, pan-africanism yeah, yeah, and yeah, stuff because, they get this. yeah because like today what you want to do we we get for mm. the divide the program maybe into two segments because mm -hmm. you the man you are grounded which like mm. if possible here you they talk about issues uh, mm -hmm. way related to politics, then go fish in a day no more. So, man, mm -hmm. who will say, okay, you're not a scientist. Well, mm -hmm. if we say scientist, some people they don't even know, okay, then go say, okay, oh, this person is so scientist day, but now mm -hmm. you don't talk about all that here, what you don't do. So, how prepared mm -hmm. is Sierra Leone now for able to repel anything like COVID or like Ebola? How, how mm -hmm. you feel salon prepared as a result of your work? You know, um, we don't we don't definitely build up some level of preparedness. Um, and I would say um compared to Sobin Day when uh Ebola hit we in twenty fourteen, we they in a better position in terms of um you know um capacity, manpower. We still get a long ways for go in, in some things. We still get a lot of challenges um uh when it comes to infrastructure um several of the other things and we um will require more will for um uh, for law we able to achieve but um 
some areas we they do well uh, at this point compared to so been there in uh, in 2014 um and we don't set up a lot of um you know uh you know structures in place uh trainings and and and, and some capacity um the challenge is uh, for you know when you look at um you know uh, things like a public health system now a, a system you know it's a system in service people are like where you go play football um in in a football game mm -hmm. you got to get a very strong 11 or 16 players and each of those players and they you know need forget uh, one weak link and viruses way or infectious diseases or in the health system if you get a one weak link or one area you know, disease will always exploit that area. The other things that will exploit, Tumbu will always exploit that area. They and he strike una. So if the, if for instance, uh, uh, we not get a strong electricity network in the country, then they affect you, your lab. It will affect you, your yeah. health system mm -hmm. because uh, most of the 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 the, the research or they do the equipment they or they use. You know, for instance, me get a experience of um, a, a hundred and twenty thousand dollars freezer where we bring na Freetown for me work. A hundred and twenty thousand freezer blow up na Freetown because the light no good. Wow. You know, yeah, yeah. Right now we just it's just did in the lab for be a, a, a storage thing for the boxes. Then this na expensive, expensive over um you know um. Ninety thousand dollars for buy this, over ten thousand for ship them to Sierra Leone, and and set them up and all this stuff. But it blow up because of bad light. Uh, you know the work. I know you know the work. And, and now you continue a system no day for whole the electricity company then like heads up accountable for for them. Uh, exactly, exactly. So so when then thing and they so what they talk about so the public health the systems those are all the things. So where the light no strong. You know, stable. You know, they able to bring certain equipment. Some certain equipment are able to work. And then, when you think of water system, water also get for day twenty four hours. The system get for day. You know, when they think of um clean system, the work then what we they do in the lab. Some of we lab systems need very very clean. You know, the water not for be any for be very sterile. And for able to get systems for set up all them system then they say no contamination not this so that not in a day because for instance uh, if i say i they go take your own blood sample and then amplify them through pcr or make them learn no what thing you get you your own gene um if water contaminated i put something there you know go now the result no go be valid anymore because what in that thing they do are find that contaminant in addition to what thing you get from you. So it they, they give very, very uh, a bad result. So now you make we need all them thing and day for setup. So now I make as I say, we still get challenge. These are the challenges we get uh, and I make the system overall get for be you know uh, strong and then of, of obviously also um you know a lot of other areas and they you know you know the infrastructures building spaces um you know and and also uh, even people getting sometimes the required trainings them the right trainings and also critical and 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 also the the incentives sometimes so people get trained um the incentives not in there then end up for going out other then take a job other places um then go down train but then then you know uh, maybe ngo come or other thing come they move there because then they get paid better so then go left the system so these are all things we go affect because when you now get an outbreak or something then people then they you don't lose them mm -hmm. you know you don't lose yeah. that manpower they're not they're not there so you know they're able the one that we go say la recruit these people they not get the knowledge and the know how for for what is that so so now i make us say you know we get a lot of um improvement what they do but also we need for think of the 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 wider system the wider system need for work yeah okay mm -hmm. thank you so much uh family mm -hmm. this yeah when i watch the dinner now today i deal with professor njai uh we a scientist and you don't do boku boku thing for salon, uh, like but we get for come into specific the thing the way you don't do. But right now they talk about 
in like the work way related to science uh, to science and other things they don't do so many research about Sierra Leone about Ebola about COVID and then thing and day. Dr. Jai, what is the attitude of let's say government towards your work? Whether you they get the required support for able for build this infrastructure where you they talk about? Yeah, I mean for the most part, yes. I would say the the, the support they they work um, closely with um, uh, people with the ministry, uh, the Ministry of Health, um, and uh, you know other areas. And obviously, in my own capacity, um, I would say you know you can always want more, let it be more, um, you know. But uh, they get you know what I uh, need, you know, for let me able uh, succeed. But I would say, um, you know, on two areas, I think we, we you know, we're going to need more for lay we move from, you know, um, this level to be up, up, up the next level. Like that, that kind of support they he, he highly needed. Um, you know, but um, in terms of um, you know the 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 the, condi the atmosphere for that like, do what are they do and 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 getting the necessary uh, collaborations, um, it happen. And also, I think um, on my own part, also um, taking me time for go above and beyond me own time for support the government um, in what they do because um, I provide them a lot of. Um, um, at least for the Ministry of Health uh, and, and the, the uh, livestock and agriculture, and then the Ministry uh, of uh, EPA within uh, uh, Environment Ministry, um, then all day within the One Health um, um, uh, 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 program, One Health platform, and the One Health platform are the chair, the One Health platform, the technical working group. And so basically, uh, for me, as a service to the country and as a scientist, um, we get a lot of experience globally uh, and globally uh, and work in you know, uh, the global space. I able for if it's a you know if not a proposal then get if not grants then get or if not idea thing then, then concept then one develop or not thing we um, uh, important for 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 build a lab system or or other aspect of the public health or something, I I try my best as possible for um, provide all that support for government because in the end, at the end of the day, it's for the people of Sierra Leone and in, 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 in important for the, the, the technocrats and the policy makers for get and right. And if they're able, and so for me, it's been like, um, in a free service, I know they, I know they ask for pay for this, and, and you know, and uh, something that they do um, almost uh, routinely. I never ask for um, you know a salary from government. I don't ask for anything. I just feel like um, this is a service that I have to do. And in turn, I mean, they you know they able bring some of my own projects. We um, you know as I talk about now, I don't just talk about the the. The, the surveillance project we had to work on with the ministry uh, in the different hospitals, and 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 basically also they try for do these things align with government because uh, for me it's the way in which we were able to bring the signs and the policy makers for let them see that this is important so that I know they only do I mean isolation um, and at the university but also I want for let them be part of it for understand that then we're able now take the action. So for instance, uh, if we see a lot of dengue, we see a lot of chikungunya, or we see a lot of um, um, uh, you know, um, syphilis or other um, major uh, tumbud and other hospital, we currently hospital, most hospitals and then they test for, it will be prudent then for like, the ministry and the government begin for make those as mandatory things within the hospital so that people will get the right uh, test systems, the right things, and begin for work on how to develop those long term, that capability, you know, in uh, different facilities then. So so now that for me, I did get that uh, thing. And I and I think we de don't develop over a time, long time, a build building that relationship and trust. Because uh, since Ebola, 
you know, in the former government, uh, been done come at the work, I set up one of the big um, uh, consortiums um, um, with the uh, university in the US, University of Tokyo, University of Wisconsin, and then with the uh, University of Tokyo in Japan, and then with a uh, 34 military hospital, we set up this consortium, set up a lab. So that was during Ebola. And then at the time I worked with the uh, the former uh, government and all those people and, 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 and build the same sort of um, relationship for which eventually yielded results with the Ebola, the vaccine, and able to get more understanding. We, in fact, much of the what in the world today understand about Ebola, like mostly come from some of we studies and what we do and the work then some of the papers where we publish and work. So I think it's, you know, and I think I think continue, you know, so, with so uh, get, until the present. So we get we get the vaccine as a load right now in case. So we do, we get, uh, not necessarily, you know, state in Sierra Leone, but we get a uh, uh, team for able to get them, you know, anytime, you know, we get an issue. Yeah, we'll get that deployed. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay, thank you so much, Dr. Njai, mm -hmm. or Professor Njai, thank you so much. We appreciate mm -hmm. for your time. And mm -hmm. also, Unaki, we they see some, nah, some, the provinces, some people learn them, but they they swell or something that they kill a lot of people. Them, when I can really, when I don't do research on that for find out what in the cause, then in the way some man they get liver problem. They see young people and they die. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, so all of those things really, most of them can be sometimes as a result of an infection. Um, so liver diseases are very common, um, for we own parts and most of the liver diseases sometimes can be viral related, um, you know, and other, other, um, uh, you know, tumbu them, you know, can be responsible. Um, things like uh, hepatitis can cause liver issues. Um, same with other, you know, uh, tumbu them with and similar to ram can also cause, cause that, you know, uh, swelling of the liver and and inflammation. So a lot of you know, uh, tinder can do we we can easily preventable. You can easily cure them if you know the diagnosis. Um, and a day um, be be some of a bigger problem because without um, proper diagnosis, the the doctors are blind to what in uh, they go on. So then. Uh, and 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 when you look at fevers, uh, whenever something uh, fever, we they always attribute them to malaria or to typhoid, um, and simply because we not get the capability for diagnose further, and 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 so, uh, but plenty of things can cause fever, and and so now that now that really we try for now build for really for really for really understand. Uh, that and able for increase we we health system capability um, in country. Okay, thank you so much, Do, uh, Professor Njai. Uh, mm. You don't you don't again find out like for know which kind of sickness they kill the most people in a salon. Um, so that um, uh, yeah, so those are more about uh, some epidemiological studies. Uh, so so basically, um, it, 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 it difficult for determine at the moment. Uh, okay. But um, if you take uh, some of what we observe, so in Sierra Leone, honestly, you at this point, you know, you get a, a, a thing between some of the more um what we will call like a tumbu related infectious disease um then, but also you get the bigger one that now we don't they become bigger the hypertensions the the diabetes you know those are the, then they become bigger and bigger now um in Sierra Leone and 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 in fact i would say then are some of the a big silent killers then now not the, not the communities then and people because of um one you know the lifestyles people knocking know exactly you know um you know how to prevent them and 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 also the 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 aspect of diet you see um we diet Nasira Leone 
some people in diet largely not sugar you know if then you know then take tea then go drink bakri sugar bread um na white bread then bread then we would eat mostly na 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 this uh, processed flours and, and a lot of them then they increase in sugar levels and then of course and you know we get a lot of food then and then oil plus as per my this that so building up a lot of the cholesterols in people so then they also also they cause and you know a reason for the high blood pressure but also when you take stress levels in our society also when you think of um where you get a lot of what they call then you know structural uh, uh you know violence structural issues then we go link with stress so people then get high stress levels then they also in a, a big uh, risk factor then for what hypertension you, what, what are their structural uh, uh, stress issues then the? so things we go deal with say uh, things like uh, poverty you know um challenges just the daily challenges in life you know difficulties in life so you know it will force person for just get a lot of stress um with experience and that can now um you know now a big risk factor it can shoot up you know you worry about so many things maybe i not get this for do i not get me for pay me rent i not get stuff i not get a job i not get stuff i not get food i not get you remember so many things then till and day they just end up for increase either your pressure you know and then and then hypertension they always dry gel with uh, diabetes or diabetes always gel with hypertension so anyway would they see that and if they get younger and younger that's the interesting part that this disease they are so we before you will see somebody now when he don't get older he they begin experience dentia but when uh very recently i talked to uh dr dean and you know and uh you know now one of the 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 consultant for diabetes and 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 and, and stuff in the country and basically been tell me about this young man we come we almost day in this um very high levels of um of uh in, 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 in hypertension to the point where you, you insensate surprise that this person they alive in the waka you know so you know so some of these people just can fall and die and 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 you know even know what to make it die and say hey this person been just this so you oh. see a lot of these things happening now in Syria. hey this person you don't young person you don't die this person yeah. don't die and 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 we do a study in amakeni um we we been to take um you know before we take people and some we been want for no infectious disease there them present at the population but we wanted for also test them them for them them, them pressure them B, them bp and check them for their sugar levels and so many young people na makin over 400 so many of them majority they very hypertensive very young they very hypertensive so so this is something that is huge you know so those those are very very huge things way they kill people silently in the population and and we we get for pay attention to those ones and to me in the next few years um we may we go even want for forget about the malaria the typhoid and those will be some of the big ones for we area because of the lifestyle change um with diets and don't change also from with traditional diets then what we usually get we they mostly get a lot of we they mimic the western diet and and also we mobility don't change we need to, we need to work more we they take we they we they sit down pa motka them more we take taxi take okada take things and even the villages and now we they go then people been the worker from kabala to dogoloya kabala mm-hmm. to this place but these days bike then they honda then they for go all side for make things so then they said they reduce that with mobility for break down then tear into we body who eats them and so it you know so this thing of uh pressure and hypertension get for and diabetes sorry get for be some of the bigger killers in the next few years and added to the um the other big two when a road traffic accidents mm-hmm. road traffic accidents now also bigger uh, aspect of we population are one of the big killers them and then of course drugs and substance abuse 
drugs and substance abuse, they come very, very high up now as one of the major public health issues. For me, I'm going to say now nah, emergency level, it don't reach. We country for able, it will declare them as a public health emergency. I just get one student don't do a study on them, on just understanding the prevalence uh, free time among young people, the types of drugs and all the different things. And it just, it's just remarkable. So it's it, it, it bad. I, I, I did a church, then there's a, a one of my students when they do a, a Thanksgiving uh, thing from, um, and, you know, invite you to the church. And I get two, two young people who sit on next to me, very high on Kush, sleeping in the church, mm -hmm. right? And, and it's sad. And so to the level where they see these things everywhere in society, it's dangerous, not just for their health, not just because right now uh, the Kisi mental home, are they, are they, are they, are they try to do some research with folks now on, on mental health. And, and nearly now, the big spike in mental health issues is drug-induced mental psychosis, and our major issue. Right. So um, this has you get a lot of ramifications, so many things. So if you take drugs uh, way and then you take road traffic accidents or uh, road traffic accident and drugs come into the hospital, then they alone, they create pressure on your healthcare system, on your hospitals, them such that uh, the doctors wait for uh, for the pay attention to mama, papa, we don't come with diabetes or hypertension or other critical illness. They're not going to be able to pay attention to those people. They're going to now focus on these people where they come with either drug-induced coma or some road safety accident or road accident where some of those can be clearly prevented from you know, okay. a public health angle. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, what do you feel say now? Let because the public health, I think say now one of the, the responsibility now for engage the public, create awareness. You see anything mm -hmm. of that in a salon? Yeah, yeah, you know, you know, and I think that's the challenge we still there for we public health as a system. We that now the major challenge we still get now in country. Um, I don't think we don't get to the point where we don't able develop a very good um, education system around them and, prom and and health promotion around them. And, you know, um, we awaken to the importance of public health after Ebola. And, and so um, we just they come up. We don't really understand in power as a society and what in um public health can do because if you get a very strong public health system mm -hmm. you actually they reduce the 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 the, the 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 hospital visits or the things about people going to hospital you go you know they calm down a lot because when you take a road traffic accident um you get for now bring in you know your police you, you safety, you people them, then uh, road uh, SLR, SLRSAs, uh, even SLR go candy. Uh, you go bring in, um, you know, the, the, the school, the education systems. You they bring a lot of other aspects into them. And so you bring driver education, um, passing, you know, all those things, addition to enforcement. And, and, and so when all of those come into play, then you will find out say you go you people will be much more safer the you increase safety on the road and and when you increase those your chances also for drop those will be very very high the same way when you think about um, hypertension diabetes these are all preventable um some in 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 a lot of cases where if you teach people about people understand about diets they understand about um, also making sure then they get them, uh, you know, um, uh, then they visit them so that uh, then they then they then they get them BP measurements and taking regularly. Uh, they also understand about um, 
nutritionally beneficial foods that we then go take. All the aspects of health education and they're very important. We, you know, um, we were able, you know, reduce the incident, the risk factors then for lay somebody develop, um, you know, strokes or develop, um, you know, uh, the type two uh, diabetes. So these are things that we, if the health, the public health system strong, and a system again. Uh, it will able help. But again, the challenge is that you go tell somebody, say, eat this type of diet, eat this type of food, but with food production, with food security, very, very low. Mm -hmm. And and so if somebody for eat salad or eat uh, certain vegetables, it is eating certain fruits, you know, available, yeah. it, it's very expensive, you know, the, you cannot afford it. Like for the, the the country rest we know say the country rest get brand it get brand that brand, brand the brown thing with it on top of and we it very good for you mm -hmm. and we it, 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 it much more healthier than the white rest then we would get from you know china india and all them countries where they import to we wait and already process no get any of that and so but if the country rest not they and we know they almost get the education, say it's very important for how we grow and more. So now it make when we look at a public health system, you also get for think of not just the Ministry of Health, but you look at Ministry of Agriculture, you bring a Ministry of Education, then Ministry or Minister of Social Welfare, all these areas, because all of those need for work. Yeah, you will, need see, for be, you will see how they are interconnected. Interconnected, where, where exactly. The lack of this, they lead to this other problem. Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. So all of them for be interconnected, and 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 because the environment, yeah, for daily back, like we look environment, you know, we look free town all over the noise, all over the noise, you know, uh, pausing one for sleep, you know, go able to sleep on side, pausing one for make. So that's where you bring in the environment. You get for regulate noise. You get for regulate, create the conducive environment such that uh, thing. if somebody even sick a hypertensive now then free town he will likely die from then noise so this person they just pass and create something he just get cut out and die and so or uh, even the lack say you know the 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 the, the, the proper um environment or the for transport people we then get uh, emergency for instance then heal the road don't go build build a free town road not the for go on and now, the last time, um, Adena, the emergency operation center, we a belly woman in Freetown, he did one of this community there, he get a miscarriage, and able to take him down to hospital because ambulance never able to get there. Mm. And then let will think about the fact, say, also, if there is a fire outbreak in any of those sites, you know, they will get a, 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 a fire ladder for go up mm -hmm. there and do anything. So these are things we all part of the public health system way the you know is so interconnected so you will talk about you know them ministry yeah uh, we don't set them up all them tia but uh, one of the things we are always they try for you know advise them say these are not the need for think about we say then the touch point mm -hmm. we say the the touch points then they you know but rather what would they get is a uh, I don't find out that the country now mostly competition. Each each body one for doing your own thing, and each body one for and 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 and, and work with you within your own set of donors. And so where you get agriculture, agriculture they work on food. Mm -hmm. Ministry of Health they work with nutrition, nutrition and food for go together. Mm -hmm. But you will find out say nutrition in Ministry of Health no one talk to agriculture with food. So how then go, how we go work? You know, so in, ideally, you know, nutrition for able to work with agriculture, for now work with the community then. So the community then now know the type of food them, way then, then traditional food then, way then go they eat. You know, now then for the able now promote them with your own food then. But when you look at Sierra Leone now, you go any side now, you're hungry now, chicken and chips, chicken and chips, fried rice and this. All sign of this fried rice and, and chips, which is not good for us. Mm -hmm. All the oils and no more, then all kind of oil, all kind of thing, just the other, and eat all kind of things. Whereas then we healthy foods and then we fufu, 
then we, you know, cocoyam, cassava, then we thin them with the really healthy way. Now, what do they call um, eh, 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 whole foods, you know, in, in, in biochemistry, whole foods, and then and get what do they call low glycemic content, meaning that uh, when they get into you, the, the, they cause like your sugar go up quickly, you know, because then it's very slow, slow for release the sugar, then go release some over a long period of time. So you they get energy over a long period of time, you know, they just go and spike your sugar up high. So, so then they all, we, they, we, they, we they abandon them. And now in the interest of being civilized, we all don't civilize now. When you say, in fact, the menu now, then go tell you African dish, then tell you this dish. You know, I'm yeah. like, you know, they make they make we all look so funny. Yeah. <laughs> and we not the, yeah. and you know, and not the more healthy one. And you know, uh -huh. the, 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 when you go all over the world, the wait man, they look for the organic food. Organic uh -huh. food not the uh -huh. expensive, these are uh -huh. the expensive foods. Uh -huh. And 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 one that we you know you you need, you know, in, in, in high quantity. And whereas we now they say uh uh <laughs> now the other way around we want to <laughs> yeah thank you so much uh professor njai uh let's just let go now to other thing again like yes we recently see you don't you talk about a college where you open now your homeland where now mm. they were all born me and you we come on other side a uh, mm -hmm. lot of people there, including myself we are proud of you proud of your work we want for thank you thank you for us for what you do and explain to humble them about that college how the idea comes about and how it will work yes so um you know back in uh in in uh 2012 uh, i've been can start a, a project now kabala way uh we we'll call project 1808 and basically um the idea was then to begin for um work with young people then at the community you know from primary school and then also um, secondary school. Um, I want to start them early from then uh, JSS one with and they and then the primary school. The idea and I've been for begin for kind of um, educate them differently, and then able for think and solve problems in the community. So um, back in 2012, when I come, we start with just 56 students in the community. And we've been the I've been one for do um say I want for think about how best we de educate ourselves for how we become problem solvers, how we solve we own problems rather than basically complaining about the problem. So if you not get food, your water not clean, or you not get this issue, what in you they do for do for make sure you kind of solve that problem there so that it becomes something of of the past. Um, so, so in that process, we I come begin work with them, PKR, and then the number begin to grow, Nakabala, and we begin to see, you know, some successes among them. I, I also realize the challenge we then they face, you know, in the community, we will community they face that many of these uh, young people get for move out of that place for come up either a Makini or Freetown for come university. And and also I've been mean, always on the get the, the feeling say um whenever they come up to university again, the some of the values and things and we would try for inject into them, it always they get lost because then they come to a system where they reverse the process of what thing we try for uh would they try for injecting to them. And so, um, and I've been always done they get grapple with a problem now, not to just Sierra Leone, but across many African countries, about the fact that um, most of we universities, we colleges, um, you know, um, since independence, then just continue the same colonial system of education. And we're not able to take time for take a break away from that system and try for, um, you know, do something different and, and 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 you know not completely say we 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 abandon the systems but come we try for like begin for integrate some of we own values and we own ideas and we own systems and thinking so you know and 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 it has always been a difficult challenge for say how you go inject them into current universities they always take a bureaucratic turn 
So he came to me and said, you know, what in um, this community need, need a college, they need a university. Uh, I also get this dream for create something where it will be a model of education, a, a learning uh, thing within Sierra Leone and even within Africa and even within globally, how we begin to reverse some things. So that's where the dream starts. And, and so um, back in 2016, 16, 17, I begin um, acquire land, Nakabala, and, and uh, it wasn't an easy process. But you know, got some things, and then um, and then start start the process of putting foundations, and um, and now um, several colleagues um, globally got interested, uh, begin for support uh, the work, and that actually me part of coming and staying to Sierra Leone more because uh, it's a dream. And you're not going to ever able to achieve something of a big dream if you day far away. Now, nah, this was the main, main thing. So it involved a lot of sacrifice because as a scientist, um, you know, you, especially the level where I don't be go up more than a senior scientist, principal scientist, you, it, it, you, it's very lucrative. You get paid so much money. And now for go for you know step out of that and say you they go for completely just follow your dream and do something a lot of sacrifice but it's worth it um i think the community needed it but also um beyond the community we need for also think about how um as i say we de decolonize um localize some of the education systems and so i you know so that's how we go about it take a bit of time um over uh, five years now for develop um from 2016-17 um but we able now develop a very radical curriculum we get uh, two campuses in Kabbalah, and looking forward to start um this september we don't get with tec approval in fact tec was very impressed we don't even find and nctv also very impressed um, and I uh, get um, uh, partnerships with uh, uh, two um, universities in the U.S. Um, and more uh, trying for common board. Um, and the idea is really, for me, has always been that we need to take ownership and begin to think about education differently. And so, um, so... What I want to do at the, at the college in Kabbalah, I want it to be like a model of so learning what, because. What's the college in name? So currently, we, in fact, we, we just call them Kwenadugu College, but we're oh, open okay. for so many. We hopefully, you know, um, uh, we don't know whether that name will evolve um, or not, but as we move towards the university, but we left them for Kwenadugu College because now they pl we plant them. Um, okay. And yeah, now that's not the name. Yes. Okay, thank you so much. Uh Fambulem Una the listen and watch Professor Njai would they talk about a college where they don't establish na Kabbalah Kwenadugu district. So Professor, what in ex exactly be called a science college or na a voting? Like what in una they teach specifically na the uni uh, college day? So first and foremost, um, the values. Now, the most important, the most important thing we would try for do with the college now we values first. The values now leadership, entrepreneurship, sustainability, indigenous knowledge systems. So it means all we local knowledge systems and, and then the global education. So we they teach everything, but in a very what do they call a liberal art education, very um, interdisciplinary. So we we'll teach public health, we we'll teach environmental studies, we we'll teach agriculture. These are we big, big areas uh, because we want for, um, you know, it's a, a give them this sort of one health context. But we we'll teach um, sociology, anthropology, African studies and Pan-African studies. We we'll do all the sciences now you're going to computer science you know the science and all the thing that now we will be science and uh but what in that the beautiful thing would they also do is that the cross crosses and would they do very very specialized causes them 
okay. things like emergency disaster management uh you know um areas and way you know very 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 important you get into the job market straight away uh and then also stuff like music dance things and we we know they you know do now we now we regular universities right our regular colleges music dance art storytelling you know uh you know critical things and we important uh now we own cultures you know and 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 and, and also you know we indigenous knowledge systems and so we also they do um you know agriculture for be very strong part of we because uh, of those kwenadugu naive and falabana very strong agricultural districts and so all aspects and way they around agriculture from you know animal science livestock to making things but the key aspect for we is so much not so much of what thing will be more theoretical than the now more of the practical right mm -hmm. how you they actually do something so when you they in the college um you know you you what i want now the hands on learning you know understanding how they do things so now i make that every student where they come in for your if you they do if we, when we go into from certificate through diploma through uh university level degree four degree year yeah, degree you they get for do leadership every year okay you they do leadership every year because what we want to do is that um by the time you they done you either be a job maker or you begin for make something for yourself right you able to do something and so you they do entrepreneurships again in every year then you they do sustainability every year then you they do um you know um indigenous everyone for at least you they pick up you get forget one language where you they qualify with whichever language you choose for study but we try forget language studies Mm -hmm. So they do indigenous knowledge system. They understand some things about yourself because part of the ch and then of your, obviously we get all the global exposure where you go get, and so because part of the things we we they face is people they come then graduate but then really don't know the local context better, or they don't understand about taking leadership, or they're not able to create entrepreneurship. Uh, 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 either an idea or a business or something from what they do. So, for instance, if you can do public health um, and you do entrepreneurship within that, then, for instance, if Ministry of Health not employ you or Ministry of Agriculture or whoever not employ you as for public health, you can start your company on service delivery, health service delivery. You can start something on doing some aspect of what in then need for let them succeed, thing way they're not able to do. So that way they you they able to complement what in government they do from a more private sector business. Say they work on something. So they create things them, you know, you they able to do so many other stuff. So there's a lot of opportunities we sometimes we not can tap into because people and they just go and study something that road study and that theoretical uh, based um, you know knowledge systems. So even when we look at arts now and culture and music and other stuff, you define say all the other countries them, where then they get uh, strong, you know, arts and other stuff. Then artists and they do well on the global scale. And and you know in Sierra Leone, we need for actually bring that back into we into into we curriculums them and other stuff them and give opportunities even for musicians where then they do their own music. Then, then uh, musicians already, let them get opportunities for able to come back to the classroom, then split time. So you create flexible programs for them for able to get certification, for able to get then diploma. Then, then still, then they do then, 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 then music business and other things. And, but that also, they give them much more groundedness on what in the, you know, the, 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 the area entail, you know. So now then, then they, what it entails, what in the inside this leadership where you they talk about? Maybe what you wanna get for focus on what you wanna teach who's character in human being when they try for develop. So this is a, that's a very important question and, and, and I'm glad we asked that because um 
you know, so we they, we they teach all the aspects of leadership, how for be influential leadership, the empathetic aspect of empathy as an aspect of leadership, what are the core functions of leadership, you know, the, the leadership functions them, you know, how, you know, understanding, say, as a leader, you know, the four core functions, for instance, uh, you know, one, you for able for be able for scan your environment, understanding about how to have um, focus, getting your goals and focus and getting mobilizing resources, inspiring people. But the aspect of the, the values and way leadership entail integrity and, 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 and respect and, and, and all those, but also about, you know, um, the aspect of teamwork, you know, working with teams and being able to also work independently um, being mindful, the mindfulness aspect then, of leadership. So leadership now a huge, 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 huge area. And I remember in when I joined industry as a young scientist, um, and I spent about three years in industry just then they train you on leadership, on leadership, leadership. Why? Then they spend so much money for training me on leadership, leadership. Then the reason being was the technical aspect of the science. It's easy. I will go and go do stuff in a lab and do it in them and all that stuff. But the leadership of taking that and working with people and doing so much is much more complex. We say get for deal with a, uh, you know, um, you know, another fifty thousand employees. You get for deal with uh, global teams, and it becomes really important. And I remember when I've been needed for represent uh, the company about two or three times na na court, um, either in Turkey or in Germany or something. That's where leadership counted. Like how you know, are they engage those people? How are they talk to those um, people at the, the the Ministry of Health in Turkey or whether it's the regulators in Germany or other places? And 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 so just for people to understand that, to we. We talk about it every day today in we government, we 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 bigger political economy in Sierra Leone, and we talk about this leadership, 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 deficit leadership every day in Nadando we talk about this, this, this. But we until you are trained in it, you you know, you 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 continually reminded of it, you continually being principal in it, it's difficult for let it become part of you. And so sometimes um, in a very, very, very deliberate and intentional effort has to be done, starting from now the school level, for now begin for train people. For instance, you know, even to show up early, I can only be medical students in our college, I always remind them, say, if you want to be a, a medical doctor, not just about being a doctor, that's not the technical part. The most important part not the leadership part. Are you saying I if the if you get for being a clinic if you get for dinner clinic five a.m. in the morning, you for day day sharp five a.m. in the morning. You know that not a commitment and that not leadership. That leadership means that you get for don't get up at four a.m. in the morning or three thirty in the morning. Prepare yourself for make sure you get there on time and do that. You know thing and also make sure. Most times people wait the kind of hospital. We take them BP, for instance, and blood pressure, not because they 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 sick or something, not because they're stressed out. People get stressed out. So how for talk them? How for talk to them? How for calm them down so that that actual measurement we they take na a reflective of their own true measurement, right? If you go to walk in a lab, you know I touch animal, the animal they get stressed. So I got for calm that animal t- for a point in which you actually able. Uh, get a very good measurement from them because that now the, now the stress level gonna you go don't reduce and don't become comfortable to it. Now make you go take about a, you go take about a week or so for work with them before then you know before you actually do something we go be an experiment with them. But it's it, it's so important for say now in now the biggest part of many things you know mindfulness how would they talk how would they say things some things and they will go solve very easily. But because of the way we they talk them, we they, they antagonize the other person, and then sometimes way it happen, 
how for accept those things and say, you know, you, you, you know, look at the country, you know, it hard for let people accept, say, then don't fail. Then feel say, way I say, I don't fail. It means I'm done for. But if you say accepting that I made a mistake or I failed in this thing doesn't mean you don't fail. I just, you don't accept. Then a leadership in itself. And how for lead from before when you needed and how for lead from the back. And understanding leadership in different dimensions, whether you are a football player, whether you are a scientist, whether you go be a medical doctor, because you can be, you know, like when I join industry, uh, very young at, at the U.S., I can be a scientist all my life, and I didn't at just that low level. I just another scientist. I come every day. I do my work. I do the thing there. I do what is needed and stuff. But for let you rise up, you know, in a very competitive field, a place like the U.S., for let you rise up and be above the others. Mm -hmm. That you get for sure leadership. Something we will distinguish you between the others. Because when I all get the same technical skills, when I will get something similar, we will what is it, when I will speak the same language. But the separation therefore happen only because you show more leadership, you show thinking, you show other stuff them. And at that day, we want to teach in this program along with entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurship not really for be able to be creative. Be creative in your environment, wherever you find yourself, be creative. Not say a, for instance, a um, we sit down. If then say if this not day, this not day, I not able to do your work. Ah, hey, we not able to do. We not day, I not able. Why go now? Various. Uh, I'm the work with different uh, hospital than a salon. I don't go all the 16 district, but I can go some side way and say not get printer. And I say I know we not get, we not get printer. I say wait, we not get, uh, we not able print. Yeah, no, we not able pass it. Gonna, we gonna say okay. But I ask, I probe again and say, ah, no, we got a printer. And I say, what's wrong with the printer? Ah, uh, now one, one code will not get self one thing. I say, but we can able to go look for this code. Look for the code, can fix it on the printer, the thing work. Yeah? So you, 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 you can solve being creative, entrepreneurship. That's not just simply just something, the, the resource there with you. But we they say, you know, because we, you know, so those are things we need for change. Look, where you go now, Freetown, you did Freetown, you go now, some of these government places, you meet all Mutka, pack, 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 pack. But where you check, now, maybe in a tire, nine point, now one, maybe in a small thing, we needed just like a, a small part for change, and you don't fix it. No, well, we we'll not get Mutka. Mm. But just sometimes, just prepare what you have and fix that and be creative. So now that entrepreneurship, they now we want for empower and we picking them, so that they get any kind of skills. And they, when you get that, they you they begin for now see how the West and other countries and then develop because of you know you know aspects of leadership, aspect of entrepreneurship, you know because then they take whatever then they learn, then take it now to practical use in their in their communities and their environments and and and, and, and things that. Okay, yeah. thank you so much, uh, Professor Njai. Uh, when I watch Professor Njai, he explained to me about leadership and like the uh, college we then don't establish na uh, Kwenadugu district. Uh, Dr. Njai, people are also can wonder like normally we can see a single person they establish maybe mm -hmm. a university or a business. But the sooner they say you decide to say, you know what, I don't want to forget business with this, and then the, the project the, the university or college side. So what do you want to do put in place like for ensure that with or without you, that college day they move on? Yeah, so no, yeah, I think we, we get a uh, get a fundamental team, a very good team, uh, with Project 1808, um, a lot of partners, um, and so a lot of stuff will go on with or without me. Um, all I do is for spearhead, um, you know, the vision and the thinking. And in fact, uh, um, in the next uh, one, two years, um, for me, now for, I wanted no more forget them off the ground and moving and, you know, folks will run them. And um, what I want Nomona for bring in high level uh, uh, thinking and ideas and, and, and a vision. Me, me, for it took me a while 
um, because I know the one create um, a college or a university where go be the same again, just like any other one where everybody they do all mango can do. And no, I know I want when we talk about radical transformation of education, we get for change things. We get for think about things differently and teach ourselves differently, learn differently, and 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 so. To me, and I, and I make it take a bit of time, the thinking, um, a lot of colleagues uh, consult uh, in Africa and globally uh, on curriculum, which kind of curriculum will create that drastic uh, change what we need. Because now Africa, and this we really, really need all across Africa. We need for begin for learn with indigenous methods then, we think with systems then. Boku, boku, boku knowledge day. If you go now, then community then. I they go, for instance, uh, you know, look now, Dogolaya, I go to the, uh, the Mami Haja Keso, the, you know, uh, you the land, she knows all these different plants. All plants then, the Mami know which one, which one the key or what, which one the key or this. How would they tap into this knowledge? Now, that same knowledge we the scientists and they take, we go to lab, we take that same Moringa day, and we know the actives eh? and then we go develop medication from them. But until we develop an, as a system and now begin get like labs and now we own universities where they, where they work on Dandy, where they develop them into even low level medications and we will solve some of the problem then. We no need for import everything from the West. We no need all the technologies, everything. We know that if we become too technologically dependent on the West, then are the other way of colonization. Because then we are not creating anything of ours. So then we rest, for instance. Then we rest. I don't do, I've been sitting on a, 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 a research uh, a, a, a grant review for a, 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 this, a, 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 this rest, what we they eat. Then we country rest, yeah, then we wander away in the grow, then Makini, then Wala rest, then all that. Mm -hmm. the, then get so much beneficial. I uh, 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 use that brand, brand get anti cholesterol, you get anti cancer benefit, you get a lot of stuff. Then, when make with people and before not being getting diabetes much, they're not being getting thin and they then food, then they with them they eat. But we switched, right? We switched from then uh, uh, early colonialism, we switched to eating more sugar, eating more of sugar diet, and and then we changed the diet. These guys, when they do a thing in America for reintroduce that brand brandy into the white rice, so fortify them with that. So then they don't study the phenolics thing, all that thing. So then they try to do that so that Americans and the Americans go begin for eat that and get the benefits. So in a way, we for then here we need for promote and I make for me now the, now the value that we get for bring that we now elevate some of the systems to a point where they will go mainstream and people will begin to see the value of them. And the only way we go do them not through a university system, you know, where we where we we actually popularize them. And 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 you know and, and the other aspect I have to talk about leadership too is really about the aspect of cohesion, mm -hmm. aspect of unity. You know, we you know we go really build into all of this by bringing students. If students come out from all over the country, other parts of Africa, then they they where you don't train people in 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 serious leadership, then we really understand if they get out to the real world on how for deal with um, society. Okay, thank you so much, Professor Njai. You really they educate the public on the mm. issues here yeah, and then okay. we really appreciate you we're really glad for you so mm. lastly on this before we go now to the final uh, part mm -hmm. some build a team like we at least go help you for promote something because these are very important things we at mm -hmm. least the society need for embrace you don't get a mm -hmm. team for help you promote them here yeah, yeah. So we we get a good team, and uh, and and also um, now um, so uh, uh, various MOUs with different uh, uh, institutions. Uh, even as of today, I get uh, 
uh, two um, other colleagues, uh, one uh, you know, na MIT and others, na, uh, one other uh, institution. So the thing is, for me, it's I they try to build an organic team. Um, we get people from all over Africa and others um, in the U.S. and others here, in, most in Sierra Leone and other African countries. The idea is, you know, um, let it become more of us people, you know, a collective, you know, moving uh, things and, and use the space. For me, the space, I uh, want follow we we think of like Kabbalah, like uh, Kwenadugu as a place where then we all go able for innovate along this campus, right? Along this institution. So if you are like how, um, you know, Microsoft or Apple then come and then form Microsoft Apple. And from then there you see all these others, Google don't come out, Facebook, these others, this. So when one see we don't able to create this, you know, what I want to see is that um, somebody now, we um, want to start in say a cow milk business, now can work with the university, we can able to provide you the, 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 the technical support um for for understand how for do dairy processing dairy stuff dairy other things and and to me it's almost could almost be a simple partnership so little partnerships can can now develop where you know you get the technical support from an entity existing entity and then you can almost move on you you know your your business you know uh team so we will build those because to me the one part we know they get again still now the business aspect of universities now this part of this world like uh, so um, as a university or a college you get for be able for build and stimulate the economy now you now you communities them and it means being involved in every on all aspects of um, the economic aspect so um, my my goal now I make I say now an experiential learning. Um, all uh, some of my students, the students we will come on board um, as we move up, then will be supported with, through what you they call a work study. You go come and you will actually be employed also by the college as they go to school, but you they work on 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 projects then for the college or the university, and then in through that you go get your school fees paid your college fees paid and also you will get a stipend so for most of the the student we will come down they will give them almost a strong work experience mm -hmm. we will get but at the same time you're contributing because for me um agriculture now one of the main areas and i want to see for us as an institution getting in on the agri business within the district food production working with farmers you know working with uh, communities on 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 food systems and also processing and then the entire supply chain right so as an institution you can you can work in those in those rooms and the same way in other in other spheres and other sectors so now so currently like we get a very, very, very uh, a large number of of people, uh, teams, and people we, um, and 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 the blessing these days of the virtual connection, like what do they do so? It allow we for, you know, for engage and 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 and, and discuss uh, quite a bit, and and also um, because of me links to several universities around the world. Um, also, I don't. They very close to either. Some I don't already sign MOUs with them. Others we are very close to signing MOUs um, because again, um, my goal now for create um, this as a research hub also, um, research and innovation hub. And the thing is, most people want for do things and do good within the African system. They only need the leadership for they direct them on how for do. And 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 for me many of many of me people don't know globally that 
I'm a strong Pan-African and a strong um, vision for Pan-African ideology and thinking. And a lot of people today, whether in the U.S. or other parts of uh, other countries or within Africa, where they work with me, want to see this vision go through. And so those are some of the things we we just they build in and also make sure that um you know get some of the necessary partnership but we welcome also so many people because you have to be collective anybody with the same you get ideas you get thinking you get knowledge me will me will think now how we will move districts like Kwenadugu and falaba way now then they at the bottom of sometimes the development index but move them to become very very you know centers for innovation so we reverse would we reverse innovate the development so rather than people that now begin things in a free town now it will be them places and the kabbalah and others so imagine what we get we get a, a very beautiful environment Mm -hmm. We get uh, the cows, we get a lot of cows. We then they go then lead you into things like uh, milk, cheese, water. Uh, butter, mm -hmm. uh, you know, ice cream, and all the stuff, meat, different meat, all those. Then we get agriculture, you go from vegetables to different, different things. Then you get the tourism, you get the environment, you get all the stuff. So if we can build. This and being in Kabbalah as a town, not a, a very large, wide, and very conducive for a student environment where you can create them as a, it can become a very vibrant place for innovation for young people, just like you don't get the Bangalores in India or you get the Silicon Valley in the US. So, to me, yeah. Thank you. Also bring Abilise income for the Kabbalah city of itself. Because if students then go there, a lot of say like Naya University and they make money out yes. of foreign students them. Yes. The way students and they go and they rent houses them, you know, a very good thing. Uh, yes, exactly. Thank you so much, uh, Professor Njai. So now let's go you. again to the last aspect because we don't get much time. Mm -hmm. with the political aspects uh the tempo the rise and you mm -hmm. now want somebody way that like you already said now a pan-africanist and then mm -hmm. you don't you they you they and a person but you know they shy away from your opinion on national mm -hmm. issues mm -hmm. what do you go tell me about the current situation in sierra leone in terms of politics well you know it's 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 something where we need for really um you know uh worry about because you know things are not you know um going on you know the way we if we go um you know i mean as a country we really need for um make sure you know it's it's 62 years now since we don't we don't get independence and things are still not you know um much to write home about so we as a country i think we need for um you know think around and 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 think differently begin for act differently and that's also a challenge for we okay thank you so much and what like again dr njai some people and they blame the political class they say they don't mm -hmm. set up a system where mm -hmm. like they, now they're no more able to strive mm -hmm. we are in now the like the masses well we mm -hmm. Again, the critical masses and focused leadership. Do we have critical mm -hmm. masses in Sierra Leone and focused leadership? Both then lacking at this point. Both lacking, and I think that then we now we major problem. You know, um, and again, this is exactly if you go back to why we did try to set up things like we college or something. Because unless you build that critical mass. People were able to think and 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 able to question uh, things is still very challenging. And then the we in terms of leadership, we always think about say we not even started for 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 practice what in a real politics because when you look at the what we get right now is simply based on 
you know, party colors and and and, and whether or not um, you know um, it's now we turn for get uh, the, the the national cake and eat that. You know, it's not about saying um, now this I believe in. Now this is my ideology. Now this is my thinking. Now this how so and so. And I even even if I lose, I stand by those you know uh, values and things. Like how you go get the like, KSA na, na, na the UK where somebody could be a conservative, you know, conservative, right? Now it is somebody they in labor na labor or somebody they a Democrat na na US or Republican or conservative in thinking. And even you go to the media places. They also are sometimes ideologically driven. We still lack that yet in the system. So we not even get to that point. But I think over the years, we think those just hold we in a, you know, a lot of corruption, greed, and also a lot of, um, you know, um, this, you know, uh, short-sightedness, you know, in terms of, um, you know, we, we vision and we thinking about solving uh, issues in the society. And and then that greed, that short sightedness, they they always work for the we we the the the, the colonial or masters or the the the, the neo colonial uh, thinking again because for them, if we are not to do well, we know they think you know we not get long term thinking, we not get strategies, we not get make, then we we'll still continue for for be the ones who are calling the shots. So I think um, we need for kind of really begin for think about you know what thing will be transformational uh, thinking, transformational uh, thought process, and think outside of the box in terms of development and how we get for change the trajectory of things. Otherwise, it's very challenging. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much. But we'll go one for let you break and down for it for people them what in a transformational thinking okay so yeah so when you say transformational thinking um so so change can be like um you can be just um, a simple change like um i go from a to b right i just uh, um uh, but uh, let's say um um, a flat, like a, like I go from, uh, let us say a change. Uh, how we put them very simple. Let us say, um, you know, I just uh, maybe go change me me if I if my dress I wear I just pull this shirt here I put another shirt. Then a simple change I don't just do right. And whereas. Um, I go through a drastic makeover, you know, I go shape me hair, do everything, change me, call it, do different, different things, completely change myself, you know, to something new, you know, that can be more transformational. So transformational change can mean like, for instance, the way Sierra Leone been there, we went from, um, we, you know, say we get the war, right? Mm -hmm. And so we start, uh all them period and day from independence we come and then we get the war the war take we down to the lowest level we can get we get chaos 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 and then what thing will emerge at that point if we be completely new right and yeah. so it's transformational change is basically where you they actually disrupt everything where you've been get and now say you know what in we they start with something brand new and now it will lead you to something really, really new. For instance, you can do some things um, where you can you can can create that sort of um, you know uh, transformational uh, uh, thinking. Like for instance, when you think of um, you know the, the the U.S. then get specific movements. Now make now the U.S. you get Boku president there. You get up to forty six. Mm -hmm. But the one that we go remember. Now, the only few ones where they can do transformational change. Now, that make we remember FDR, Franklin D. Roosevelt, mm -hmm. because it brings social security. Mm -hmm. Social security creates a transformational change in America, right? You can Lincoln, <clears throat> Abraham Lincoln, now he freed the slaves. He freed the slaves. Then the old man will remember, right? You go down to Kennedy, 
Kennedy then take America to space. So all them period then they na transformational point. So na they na data they drive, as I say, like anything will be such so big that you know even you go see them, you know even need for ask somebody, you know. So when you come, you they see if it's very reflective, the change, it they change everything. The outlook, you they see them. Like, you know, you know, you no need for you know, you, you no need for tell somebody self. You don't you don't see them. You know, you, you now then can't change and they you know uh, needed and 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 important for we, you know, from we own you know for we generations the generations to come and future generations because for instance poverty now a big part of we we now every from 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 the 60s we they keep writing poverty 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 what if somebody come and move nearly almost all the population out of poverty and move we like what in magufuli do na na tanzania in four years, you move Tanzania to a middle class economy, people. So if you can able, if you, that can be transformative. Nine Lula been doing a Brazil. Where he come, Lula say, yes, he say, he say, he say, now this, I need for move this much people every time, you know, um, out of poverty. The same thing way China don't do in terms of uh, moving people out of poverty. So these are all things you can come in and say, this is not a transformative goal way I want to do, and I want to do them within this period of time. Now they try to talk about. So, yeah. so but how, how difficult it is for achieve denting in this? A, 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 very, a, a very difficult, but also doable. Okay. Because we go need to forget we we need forget as a small country like Sierra Leone we need forget a national agenda right um and because you know um even countries way bigger way than well established than democracies then the the plans are not changing based on on the parties the the only thing where they change now the way the approach for execute the national plan. Mm -hmm. So if it is taxes, if it is taxes, for instance, the Democrats will get an ideas of taxes, the Republicans will get an ideas of taxes, right? Um, and typically Republicans are more conservative than go one for conserve, then you don't think, then uh, 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 things then. Uh, minimize spending, cut down on spending and all those kind of things. So, if we get as a small country, you sit together. That's why then Bintimani tree they may be very important. Then and 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 but you not you not still late. We can able get as a national country, uh, uh, country uh, 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 as a country, a cohesional discussion, national cohesion discussion. Get everybody. This will be driven by the people. Get everyone get political parties, get every function, everybody in every sphere for come, then come sit, we all sit together. And in this space, if it be a space where we know they create this uh, inequalities, all man with and they will not all they come, all man for come, not to where they come, you know to this, you know to that, you know to this, no. We, not, we all come sit down, technocrats, your best minds, your team, your your mommy with the kailaun, this that. When I go don't do all them district, get the best. No make them. Then when I come see them, when I formulate for starting with the constitution, then coming down to what are the critical needs for the country and the big needs. Like for instance, if we say as we national agenda, we want for make a bridge to Lungi, it becomes a national agenda. So, successive governments can work on it. Hmm? Whether or not this government can or not, this government, it no matter, because the, this doesn't be part of that agenda. You know, then um, when the campaigns then they go on, the debate will not be about making 
something here or something. It's about who that will give you the most cost effective strategy for make that bridge. That's how the debate for be. If it is, if we don't say, if we say, for instance, um, food security is a national agenda, then we will make the debate between the parties based on that, about who that will give you the best strategy. Achieve that. Mm -hmm. achieve that. Who that mm -hmm. will make you achieve that, you know? And then you say jobs. You say this. So now, this, so now that we will look evaluate side by side would i give you the best up you know the the strategy or the best ideas on how to to get to that and 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 there might be ideological differences so now they the ideologies then will come in ideological differences can come in but the end goal for be the same thing the end goal we get lunge bridge the end goal we get food security the end goal we get this so, so that way, for a small country like us, we go able to conserve with resources. We go able to make sure, say, we know they get, um, when this one come, it reverse everything where this one do. This one can reverse everything with. So, when they start again, all over again, when they begin for go, you know, it's like within uh, this, uh, at Independence, I write this article, like you, they run in, they run, but they run backwards. Backward, yeah. 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 Okay. Professor Njai, I think say you mm. don't touch uh, na the key side way now problem because I just give you an instance. Mm -hmm. We've been get the Kavala project, that water project. I always talk about that water project. Mm -hmm. I believe they be launched in 2014. Mm -hmm. At some point, I believe say before 2018 elections, mm -hmm. they be try will be Kavala. They be test them pipes. Then begin yes. some villages. Then begin get water. <laughs> All yes. of a sudden, where this SAPP camp, we know mm -hmm. hear about that project day again. We know yep. hear anything about it. Then, yep. not to tell, we see again because what I raise, I write an article. Some people then begin give me articles. Them, then mm -hmm. I just hear it back. A project where them in don't launch. Then mm -hmm. say father, we don't go launch back another project. When about yes. water? So yes. like you feel say like the politicians and get that mentality where you they talk about for lay continuity day and that. Uh, for develop the country, we well, not for just claim ownership. Somebody say, okay, now SAPP do this or now APC do this. You know, if you say that they back now serious obstacle to develop it, it is. And and I make, um, as I say earlier, the critical mass that critical mass where you mentioned earlier, now is still needed because when you, you see now the, now the people now then they give back to politicians. Mm -hmm. But are the people also for understand how much power then wield as a people? So if you understand how much, now the people also for say resolve for creating this national agendas, and also resolve for say we this is how we want things to be done, because at the end of the day, what we don't reverse now is really on the mandate about who holds the power. Mm -hmm. We the elect people and vote them in and we assume saying that they hold the power but power lies in the hands of you the electorate the voter and all the things and then collectively as a people if people then now say because when you look at all over the world if you look even like max Karl marx marxism max they're not the politician they were mm -hmm. philosophers who developed devised ways of organizing themselves when you look at the US, the capitalist system, Republican systems, wasn't devised by the politician. It was devised by philosophers who taught it, and then and then it became systems by which they can do. So most times now they would not miss out. And again, again, that again, even bigger part, we we universities not even the important in the whole process. And I make I always say, whenever you get weak system. Okay, fumble them. Uh, this na cycle John Barry. We just lost uh, Professor Jai. We've been to talk about uh, political issues. Then about Sierra Leone. We've been to explain about system. We how we operate. We forget national agenda and stuff. Then they but it just go off. We no say 
the usual problem, the internet, uh, maybe or electricity problem. But would you wait and see? Okay. Oh yes, okay. yes, sure. Yes, yeah, sorry. Sure. Yes. So, so as I've been to say earlier, I said whenever we you get um, you know um, a system where people, we people, are able to hold. Uh, we we systems them responsible with politicians. We able, you know, the system when the systems and they function really really well. You go see say the people, the institutions we then create, then also are so powerful. I mean, think about the fact say we just don't see indictment of Trump in the U.S. Yeah, on thirty seven counts, mm -hmm. right? You see how a system worked, that the man was indicted, he came, he can't answer, he wrote himself and all those things. So the systems, when you create, when the systems have been created and the institutions and those and everybody abiding by those, right? Um, regardless of how you disagree or whatever it is. So we get for really think about how for these systems only oh, now, hold on the try for say as democracy we therefore really customize them to we own context and develop systems around them we it work within we context also you see when you look at the us then get then it take them time before they get to this point where they are even this electoral college today you know, you go win popular votes in the US, but you yeah. don't still win unless you win electoral college. That mm -hmm. not in your own, that not in your own way, then don't customize then democracy, right? Then don't customize on that way. And even that, over time, then go for look and examiner, and whether or not you get for work or not over time, then go still examiner. But then don't customize them. Before then get to this two term, then we don't get people where they three term, four term, like Roosevelt day for four terms. Okay. Right, other ones that day for longer, so they mean don't get to a point. So you they customize things. Britain, who they admire, then still get the monarchy, now not the major thing, mm. you know, regardless of who's kind of mess or what himself Boris Johnson do, then go list the, the average British no say the monarchy is the key. Mm. So, so we within Africa, we they try for perfect you know, Western systems of democracy, but we need for really try for customize them within we own local context and understand them so that, you know, the average person understand what it is. For instance, take this election now where they go on right now the next few days. How many people in Sierra Leone know the PR system? How many people know it and they vote for self? Mm, yeah. Right. Because when we talk about democracy, it's about demos, it's about the people, it's, ab it's about having everyone involved in the process and everyone being a decision maker. If me, Mama Na Kubola, when I crank up, Mami, it on in us, be English, and you already don't speak in English, you know, don't lose her, mm -hmm. you don't, you don't lose her, yeah. And is she now is she now disenfranchised in your democracy? Yes, she is, because you're not able to partake. Mm -hmm. If you don't say the language of communication, now na, na this language, over sixty percent of the population knows how to speak that language. They you don't disenfranchise them. Mm -hmm. So now you make the, the we get for really contextualize the things and begin. Moving forward, we really need to understand how we de localize with democracies and make them let it work for we. So if na Creole we say we talk, let all man talk Creole. Let everybody talk Creole. If na this now we we if with the same manifesto, manifesto, the manifesto for the in Kranko, Limba, Fula, all man for understand and the mummy to the village for understand and so that everybody for participate otherwise on this, this, this is a democracy in a very powerful system but you can also easily disenfranchise people based on they make all other country and then they do all kind of thing we see now the us europe others then go try even though racism they 
a lot of racism there, but then we'll create affirmative actions mm -hmm. for make sure say others then get up. Because you get for make that, because if you not do that, you don't defeat the purpose of democracy. So now it make we really to me it will not still will not still start it. I just play with the play. <laughs> to me to me. You know, because and 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 to be honest by right if you get majority like for instance you go kwana dugo you go even kaila you go project most, most people they're not going to sabi they're not sabi read english they're no literate in stuff but you go meet mami them now then communities they with them they them very very good part the way man they with them they're very very good they could actually go for honorable stuff now then communities but if you say English, you don't disable, you don't, you don't alienate them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So even the parliament, where they put them, where you say speak in English, in the parliament, they're not able, mm -hmm. right? Because you don't, you don't make them then turn moon at the parliament. Yeah. But if you say English like uh, Creole or even other things, then they're gonna be more effective in representing, in representation. So we get to think about so many aspects of we with with yes. democracy where we need for kind of um for make them better and and currently we still challenged. Okay, Professor Guy, thank you so much. We'll not get much time again. We really appreciate you. I think I will get two more questions for you. One, yes, sir. Uh, now we they see you they talk about institutions. Like if you mm. make a reference like America, even when Trump lost the elections, if you be mm -hmm. left to them, then for fair way it makes Dabaru way for turn and down. But you mm -hmm. see the institution, the institutions are manned by people. Mm -hmm. So it's like, is it that we because it's their mentality? Like when mm. it comes to certain things, they go say, No, all man they say, you know what? I like my best friend because you remember the vice president mm -hmm. uh, for Trump, you know, agree. Mm -hmm. so, we get like what is the mentality of Sierra Leoneans? We, we not reach that stage today, or we get far from reaching that stage where somebody could tell the leader, say, No, this is not right. For us. You know, we we not there to that stage yet, and I learned the problem right now because I think that we feel that the executive na in na now, whenever we elect them, we feel like it's in our God. Mm -hmm. and we they worship them and then it's about them selecting people for these different institutions and positions we technically those people should be independent mm -hmm. and, and 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 technocrats and are the, na, in institutions you not for necessarily even change them then technocrats them for the throughout those are the people we regardless of who come them for Dede. Mm? And, 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 and in the make, sometimes the big difference will we get Nayasu. Because basically, people, if, if for instance, um, I make the point the other day, we um, Nigeria, the place in Nigeria today, so if the Nigerians have been done select the referee, now then select the linesman, now then select the match commissioner, now then uh, uh, everything then do then we also control all that so now in making democratic systems one are truly one for do democratic systems the the bodies then we then really important with regards to critical issues of the state for be separated and then for be able for operate independently when you look at the judiciary the judiciary for be independent very independent the the, the 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 parliament the legislators for also you know exercise a high level of independence so when it comes to for instance when you look at what happened with trump you see a uh, uh, biden and mm -hmm. not even make any statement mm -hmm. not say anything because it's lee is basically the judiciary when the other time them turn on biden himself as a president for also say them for them for yeah, 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 what is if I investigate them for those same issues mm -hmm. with regards to um, uh, um the, the, the documents and the, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. so 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 it means so the 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 the, the, the judiciary has to be 
independent. Enough for swing because this man don't care, this one car, all man they interpret them the way they you know uh, interpret them. And when you go to to to, to parliament, nominees, for instance, from the the the, 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 the government go for go through scrutiny. If the uh, 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 team boy here with the final say, anybody where they nominate, if they go parliament, then they approve you. Then they approve because the the the, the systems, you know, are just uh, everyone. The everyone becomes just answerable now to the to the to the executive body. So I think this is where we they force a long ways off um, in with systems, and I think we really need. Um, for do much more along this um and and in terms of um the the the, the health of we democracy and and i think the other aspect we the affect we greatly is that every aspect of we political economy when it comes to um you know we governing with self the nation state we don't link electing of government to um, this ethno regional resource allocation yeah. right so the elections don't uh, of uh, in it, it's not so much even from you know um, uh, electing a game based on ideas or whatever it is it's now just based on the fact say if you elect somebody um, all the resources and stuff go can to me your region. Mm -hmm. If this one uh, win, everything else they go to this one in region. So I think this one of we main thing what we need for the link, mm -hmm. we need for cotton away from the the this um, the 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 the, the whole um, politics of we country because if we able for solve that problem there. Then most people go find out, say, then go even now want for vote for somebody else. Because right now, if somebody they not the Southeast, he's afraid this party don't win, then go then they take Alvin to over here. And this one waiting at the not north, northwest, you also say if this other party win, hey, then the, everything will come to the other side. And so we don't become much more the aspect of time, resource allocation to ethnicities and region and that's dangerous for a democracy you know in any in any society so i think those are to me the things we and for any nation state for tribe it therefore really avoid that danger that danger of uh, being fragmented into into ethnicity and regional stuff now I make these aspects of national cohesion creating a national agenda because now if you don't get a national agenda, it no matter who that win. If they don't say the light, get that water, like the one we mentioned, so that water project na Kabbalah, mm -hmm. where APC been don't start. The water don't dit it and don't pump and we near we did been get tap, we been don't pump, they don't start and then don't then don't uh, show the water. Mm -hmm. Imagine say if this government been can that agenda been they say Kabbalah, that water they for done. This government to just continue and donor. Mm. You know they come about for say you to start something new again and do, walk into something, change all of that. So so it's a it becomes a continuity when you have an agenda. So when you have a national agenda, where they address issues for every district, every community, every ward na the country. In fact, before we they even get the agenda. When they get expert, then they go to every village, every community in the country. See what in this community go need five years, 10 years, 15 years, 20 years, up to 50 years. This country, this what in, one of the biggest problems in Sierra Leone, and as an extension, most African countries, with the only plan for today and tomorrow, what will they eat? We've, we we planning, we, we're very short-sighted in we thinking. Now, right now, today, today, what will they get? What will they do today? The difference between we and why make the the, the West then still day ahead of we is that everything where you see today, where you did, USA, you did in the UK, or USA, can go in America or other countries, 
everything we see there today, they operate. Not of today. It will not start 50, 100 years ago. The cell phones today, what would they use today? This is technology we've been done start over 50 or 60 or 100 years ago and eventually came through the military and then later with the military done done with them, they now push them to civilian, right? So the, 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 the planning for everything for done day, you forget a 50 year plan, a 100 year plan. So every village, you have to know what are the projection for the village in terms of the population, then make it a do then census here. We will now we don't sit on then census here, we will go try for do error pana. Yeah, we we'll politicize them. Yes, then make you do these things so that you they get correct figures. You they get correct figures so that you now a science, this is not a technocrat that you they use, not a politics, not for the pandas. This no, you see now, other, you see, the problem for we, everything we don't put politics. But where you get a country, certain things and they win a politics. Yes, the level of the ministers, then other things and they politics, they policy, they then certain the politics. But where it's technocrat, people doing their work. If you go to Ministry of Health, chief medical officer down, all not technocrats. Those are technocrats. You leave them to do their work. That's technocrat, completely technical. When you need policy briefing or something, minister, upwards, this, that, you know. Okay, professor, you know, uh, professor yeah. Jai, you don't really, really try. Um, we've been the talk, we've been agreed for one hour, but we don't yeah. have two hours now. The next so. but Thank finally, uh, I think we'll just get three minutes. Mm -hmm. But what I want to let you summarize this for we and before you say goodbye. Mm -hmm. People and they blame the politicians or the educated people. Then. So mm -hmm. while others they blame the masses, the one the way they vote, say now they vote on uh, based on tribalism or particular. Mm -hmm. Would I you who say if you say the problem there? Because I don't go say would I blame, but who say if you say the problem there? So I think any blame for we the we the, the both the educated elite and the and the politicians. And I think and I get a reason why. Um, because you see, this we countries, yeah, no, we know not to we grandpa them form this country, not to Baibure form this country, not to any of we great grandpa them form this country. So as a result, the country we formed, not to one we any of we traditional people them understand this country we form. This country we form now. Now a colonial construct, now the British then former. And then the British then now pass on an, a Western education and a Western system. And we will go to school and the politicians, now we get that benefit for understand that system. And when at independence, we choose for continue with that construct they will then, will then create. And so first now they will make the biggest mistake as elites because at that point they as elite who for don't switch them back for Africanize them and make them sure say the people then understand them and understand the system. And since then, we not do effort for then educate the people in a way then go understand this system we, we they go forward with. So rather for maintain class, because we not elite, we don't go study, we don't get this thing. We don't get them privileged now. Then, then, then uh, we farm with all in our village. They see we as educated bookman, then educated politician. Then they see we as another god. Them, mm. then we people then they worship we. Then mean they worship we for Lord we be then savior them because we don't get this opportunity. Forget this elusive Western education we then not get, mm. and so then begin worship rather than we now turn for solve them problem them turn for bring them up and turn for kind of enlighten them so that they will get the consciousness where they need we rather begin for look like we now the colonizer the way they can we begin look them down uh, and then uh, them backward then savage then this and so in the end way time reach would they go to them we use them Hey, when I vote for me, when I do this, me and this, and then when I try now, when I pitch, then tribal, 
within the now. Hey, you know, say me, na me no more don't come for represent to now. If not this and this, this, this now. So so you begin use all these sort of things. These people don't live together in their communities harmoniously, harmo in harmony for years, for centuries, and don't live together. Now all of a sudden you come, you say, ah, them people here, yeah, eh, na me don't care, don't come for can say vuna, this, uh, this, 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 and then you use them, they vote for you, you, you run back, you don't, yeah. they take, they like, right now if you look at Sierra Leone, most people, they go again to those communities after five years or four years or three years then now then they go in frequency giving bags of rice and all this stuff and then you know people they dance people out and then they, they get elected and then 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 forget about the people again so i think to me it's it's a we cannot blame the people they can they don't know any better they 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 don't know any better now now the, now, now the only now the challenge that we'll get now this country you get people they go in rallies thousands of people standing they go and stand and talk to these thousands of people who know no better about why they are even there why they are voting you know look at um we will um space now this country the only thing people know right now na green or red that's what the whole political space reduced to and the whole thing, the L and uh, element of ideology we left with me. The only ideology we left with we, with we politicians, now we turn for it. That's not the only ideology. Okay. Now we turn uh, for it. Yeah, Professor Njai, uh, you really, we really appreciate you. This is now how we end the program. We thank you so much, and we we go wish we not say you so busy, but we mm. go wish that you will come one day so that we will expand on these issues we talk on them thank you very much thank you for having me thank you okay, okay. thank you so much uh Fambulem, yeah Fambulem, this now how would they end the program today uh i'll be the talk to professor njai uh you don't talk about so many important issues them mrs f i don't learn a lot and i believe say a lot of una would all learn so now so we the end the program this is Nasaiku John Barry, uh, Adisei Tata.